is a transform. Solution of difference equation. So solution of difference equation by is a transform method. Formula is a transform of y of n equal to capital F of z. Is a transform of y of n plus 1 equal to is it f of z minus is it y of 0. And third formula is a transform of y of n plus 2 equal to is it square f of z minus is it square y of 0 minus is it y of 1. The last third formula is a transform of y of n plus 3 equal to is it cube f of z minus z cube y of 0 minus z square y of 1 minus z y of 2. So this is the fourth formula and etc. Similarly, it continue uh, as usual. Okay. So this is the formula for the in the z transform solving difference equation. We have to use these formulas. Okay. Now the first problem based on the uh, solving is uh, difference equation using is a transform method. Okay, now uh, solve u n plus 2 minus 3 u n plus 1 plus 2 u n equal to 4 power n. Given that u of 0 equal to 0 and u of 1 equal to 0. Sorry, u of 1 you take u of 1 is equal to 1. Okay, u of 1 equal to 1. So now I am going to solve this difference equation. So now the given difference equation can be written as u of n plus 2. It can be written as u of n plus 2 minus 3 u of n plus 1 plus 2 u of n equal to 4 power n. Taking is a transform on both sides. Taking is a transform on both sides. So now is a transform of u of n plus 2 minus 3 into is a transform of u of n plus 1 plus 2 into is a transform of u of n is equal to is a transform of 4 power n. So taking is a transform on both sides. Okay, now I am going to use the formula. Already we discussed about the formula is a transform of u of n plus 2. Already we discussed about the form formula based on y in terms of y, but, but here in terms of u. So is a transform of u of n plus 2. What is the formula? Is it square f of z? minus z square u of 0 minus z u of 1. So this is the formula for z transform of u of n plus 2. minus 3 into z transform of u of n plus 1. The formula z f of z minus z u of 0 and plus 2 times of is a transform of u of n. Is a transform of u of n is f of z. The last is a transform of a power n. 4 power n. a power n means z by z minus a. So z by z minus 4. Okay, now I am going to substitute. Put the value given. What is that? u of u not equal to 0, u1 equal to 1. So that put u of 0 equal to 0 and u of 1 equal to 1 here. So now, z square f of z, u of 0 is 0, so now minus 0, u of 1 is 1, so minus z. Minus 3 into z f of z, minus u of 0 is 0, plus 2 into f of z, equal to z by z minus 4. Okay, now, I am going to separate f of z. So you see here the, the term having f of z, here also f of z, here 
here also f of z. This is only not containing f of z. So that the term I am going to take into right hand side. So now keep f of z terms are here. So now z square and here also f of z term the coefficient minus 3z. So minus 3z. Here f of z term plus 2. Take f of z commonly outside which is equal to z by z minus 4. Now this is the term not containing f of z to, so that you take into right hand side plus z. Okay. So now after this I am going to simplify you see uh, uh, after uh, you can say, uh, factorize this z square minus z means this can be factorized there z minus 1 into z minus 2 f of z is equal to this term can be taken as LCM so take z minus 4 here so z plus z into z minus 4 by z minus 4 so now take z inside so z plus z square minus 4 z divided by z minus 4 so now finally I want f of z only. So f of z equal to z square minus 3z divided by take these two terms in right hand side. So z minus 1 into z minus 2 into z minus 4. So now I find I, I found f of z. Okay, so in here hereafter I am going to apply inverse z transform by partial fraction method. So what is partial fraction method? Already we discussed about the partial fraction method. For partial fraction method, I want here f of z by z. So in the numerator, take z outside and take into left hand side. So take f of z term. So this become f of z by z equal to z minus 3 by z minus 1 into z minus 2 into z minus 4. You take equation number 1. Here I am going to apply partial fraction method in the right hand side. So z minus 3 by z minus 1 into z minus 2 into z minus 4. This can be written as a by z minus 1 plus b by z minus 2 plus c by z minus 4. And now I am going to take LCM. LCM means in the numerator you take first z minus 3 a. What is a? A denominator is z minus 1. So cancel z minus 1. Remaining term these two. So a into z minus 2 into z minus 4 plus b into b denominator term z minus 2. Uh, eliminate z minus 2. Remaining these two term z minus 1 into z minus 4 plus c into denominator z minus 4 so remove z minus 4 remaining these two term z minus 1 into z minus 2 so now I am going to put value for z so put z equal to 2 first so when you put z equal to 2 here put z equal to 2 so which implies put z equal to 2 2 minus 3 minus 1 equal to when you put z equal to this it will be cancelled c will be cancelled here only 2 minus 1 1 so b into 1 2 minus 4 minus 2 so from this b is equal to minus minus cancel 1 by 2 b value is 1 by 2 and now to find other value put z equal to 4 so put z equal to 4 which implies 4 minus 3 is 1 equal to when you put z equal to 4 this is cancelled here also cancelled here c into 4 minus 1 is 3 and 4 minus 2 is 2 so which implies c equal to 1 by 6 and to find a I am going to put z equal to 1 so put z equal to 1 which implies 1 minus 3 is minus 2 equal to when you put z equal to 1 here b cancel c term cancel here only a into a into 
and is it equal to 1 means a term a into minus 1 and here put is it equal to 1 here 1 minus 4 minus 3 so now this is plus 3 so here minus 2 so a is equal to minus 2 by 3 say so also a i found a value a value is minus 2 by 3 Okay, now I am going to substitute all the a, b, c value in equation number one. This is equation number one, which is equal to this. So that I am going to put a value, b value, c value here. Substituting in one. Substituting in one. So what is one? So one is f of z by z. So substituting one. So one implies that f of z by z equal to This is f of z by z, but this is equivalent to this. So I am going to substitute a value. A value minus 2 by 3. So minus 2 by 3 by z minus 1, and b value. B value is 1 by 2. 1 by 2 by z minus 2. So 1 by 2 by z minus 2, and c value. C value is 1 by 6. So 1 by 6 by z minus 4. So 1 by 6 by z minus 4, and now after that the z I am going to take into right hand side. So f of z is equal to minus 2 by 3 into take z here. So z by z minus 1 plus 1 by 2 into take z here. So z by z minus 2 plus 1 by 6 into take z z by z minus 4. So now taking Inverse is a transform on both sides. So now, is it inverse of f of z is equal to minus two by three into is it inverse of z by z minus one plus one by two into is it inverse of z by z minus two. Plus one by six into is it inverse of is it by is it minus four? Okay, now is it inverse of f of z? What is is it inverse of f of z? Mean the solution of the given equation. What is the solution of the equation? Solution of equation is u n. So u n equal to minus two by three into is it by is it by is it minus a a power n one power n plus one by two into is it by is it minus a so two power n. Plus 1 by 6 into z by z minus a z inverse of z by z minus a 4 power n. So this is the answer of the problem. Actually, u n equal to 1 power anything is 1, so that only 2 by 3. But here 1 by 2 into 2 power n plus 1 by 6 into 4 power n. So this is the solution of the given problem.